there were a lot of projects that happened on this particular subject, but uh, never has been showcased from a perspective of the doctors. I can only imagine what those doctors must have gone through. Recreating something like that is, that's a job too. And a big part of the performances are the set pieces where they're actually performing surgery. So I want the audience to be inside that ER. I want them to be inside the corridors of that hospital. I want them to feel what the, what the characters are feeling. So all of them went through two weeks of medical training. And one of the things we had to do was put on the gloves really quickly, which was a disaster to begin with. We all had to practice sutures and stitches and things like that. We had to look like a pro, we had to look like that we are professionals. So wearing gloves in 10 seconds, you know, making an incision, learning the terminology, it wasn't easy at all. We had Dr. Sheikh who was training us for this. He was also at the Taj on 26-11, so he is a trauma surgeon, he knows exactly what to do and he taught them. Truth to be told, you prepare as a medical person as much as you can, know your lines, but when you're on set, it's a very organized chaos. Whenever we need to do a surgery on camera while shooting, we never used to have dummy. We used to have real people. Because the camera would go from their face to their stomach or to their body part. So on that particular body part, we used to have prosthetics. So you always had to remember that the incision that you're going to do you only have to do it one centimeter. You can't go below that. And at the same time, you know, pick up scalpel, you're having to say some lines, etc. So all of that was quite challenging. It's a very mentally anguished time for all of them. On that particular night, you have terrorists in the hospital. You need to take care of the patients, of the colleague, of your staff. You need to keep operating people as well. And emotionally, it was quite draining. It became a story of the city, it became a story of the resilience of the city. Whatever you do to Mumbai, it always stands back on its feet. One has always heard the spirit of Mumbai and how these doctors really rose to the challenge. But it's something one has only heard. And for us, when the scene's coming alive, it really brought it home for us. The entire show dedicated to the first responders, to doctors. Salute to them.